let me ask you Did you create yourself or was it somebody else who had fashioned you? Cause you're a being that's impeccable, faultless and unparalleled You're a oh. product of supreme intelligence and I'm merely being rational Oh, so there yeah. isn't a camera on this. What's up, guys? Welcome to my channel. If you are new yet, my name is Divine. I'm a musical five, Minominak, drummer, and a keyboardist. I have been for many, many years. I started making these videos as a space for music lovers like myself to check out our favorite artists and break down some of our findings that make them so, so fantastic. Make sure you follow us on Instagram at the Perseverance Reaction in order to recommend the favorite singers for us to react to. You can't, you can't, you can't. What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys are feeling, feeling good. good. Hey guys, we're back. Go to new video, guys. Music, my beautiful guys. My name is David, and welcome to the Pest Guys. Right. So, they're going to be reacting to the meaning of life by Muslim spoken word, guys. You guys said our audio was very bad in our previous video, and we were really so sorry. So, we went ahead to get a new mic. That's what we're putting yeah. right now. Uh, I'm not a Muslim. We are not Muslim, we are Christians. Uh, and you guys love our reaction in our previous video and uh, you requested that we should check out more such videos. So, you guys recommend this, the meaning of life, most than spoken word. So, just decide to give it a try. You know how it is. So, okay, so why you don't more. Well. Let's get into this video. Talk Islam presents the meaning of, of life. What are we doing here? And where are we gonna go? It's like we just woke up one morning and then it's welcome to the show. Don't ask yeah. any questions, just go with the flow. No. Make as much mm. money as you can and try your best not to get broke. Copy everything you see on the TV from the hairstyles to the clothes and don't think too often, just do exactly as you're told. And if you ever get confused, then just turn towards the alcohol. You still hear your mm. thoughts? Then just turn up the radio as you learn to live a lifestyle of drugs, sex, and rock and roll. But in all mm. honesty, I just need to know, is there more to the cycle than growing and getting old? Living and dying just to leave behind a happy home and a whole lot of property that somebody else is going to own. I just really need to know before the casket's closed Cause I'm not willing to gamble with my soul Nor am I ready to take any chances These are just simple life questions And I'm just searching for some answers Like what are we doing here? And what is our purpose? How did we get here? And who made us so perfect? And what happens once we go? Or is this world all really worth it? questions we don't answer because apparently we don't really have to there's no purpose to this life and our existence is merely natural then in that case please let me ask you did you create yourself or was it somebody else who had fashioned you because you're a being that's impeccable faultless and unparalleled you're a product of supreme intelligence and i'm merely being rational Oh, For there yeah. isn't a camera on this earth that can come close to the human eye Nor a computer that can compete alongside the human mind And if the That's whole true. world was to come together We wouldn't be able to create a single fly hmm. So many signs, yet we still deny A science tries to justify that all this could come from none When it's a simple sum Zero plus zero plus zero cannot possibly ever give you one so from where did all this order come? For everything has its origins, a maker, a creator of its own. I mean, yeah. the only reason you're watching this video is because somebody had to press what? upload. Yeah. So we can believe Damn. in the Big Bang, but I'd rather believe in he who caused it to explode. Hmm. Allah, the creator of everything along with every single soul. The ever living, the master, the only one who is in control. Unlike his creation, beyond our imagination, and no, he's not a man, nor does he have any partners in association. He's on his own. And no, he did not ever leave us alone. Just like every manufacturer, he left us with an instruction manual. The Quran and Islam, and I'm sorry to jump to conclusions, but it's the only one possible. 
The only definition of God is the one and only supreme being. It's logical. A book with zero contradictions, with miracles that are both scientific and historical. All revealed yeah. over 1400 years ago. Like the detailed description of the human embryo. The descriptions of the human embryo in the Quran cannot be based on scientific knowledge in the 7th century. To the mountains as pegs holding firm the earth below. And the two seas that don't mix in a complete separate flow. To the planets yeah. in orbit oh alternating night and day as they stay in flow. The expansion of the universe and the creation of everything from H2O. To the stories of the past and the preservation of Pharaoh. To identifying the lowest point in the land where Persia defeated Rome. The gushing fluid that created man in the glands between the ribs and the backbone. And not a word has changed, it's still the same. So please explain how all this was known over 1400 years ago. To a man who couldn't read or write as he would recite whatever the angels spoke. Oh. And if you still don't believe, please try to come up with something that's even close. But you can't. So we took God as a mockery and his messengers as a joke. Muhammad could not read or write. How's somebody who can't read or write gonna start a religion? Dismiss yeah. the scriptures as legends and tales of the ancient folk As we live life according to our whims, desires and hopes Saying this life is the only home we will ever know We will live then die then simply turn to bones Yo, lo, correction After the grass dies the rain arrives and it regrows And Allah yes. promises to do the same thing to your very soul and bring you back from your very fingertips to your toes as the all-seeing supreme being watches us so close and we are surely being tested in our wealth, our health and our self and everything that we've been blessed with so believe for we will surely be resurrected and be brought back to our Lord and account for every single deed as he hands us our books and orders us to read from the bad to the good and everything in between You yourself are sufficient for your own accountability So don't be mad at me You are the one who thought he wouldn't come back to me I gave you a whole life long to search after me But you were busy in all that which was temporary So read And glad tidings to all those who believed And if you disbelieve Read and don't let that day be the first day you find out what your life really means. Read. This, this is, this was a lot to take in. Yeah. This was a lot. Um, I like that point when you said at the judgment time you have your own book you have written and show it to God so God will read what you have gone through. Mm -hmm. Whether you live your life righteously, whether you follow everything in the same accord. Like Muslims have that similarity with Christians. Like I was able to relate to him in everything he just spoke mm -hmm. right now. Literally. Everything. Everything, guys. Because science keeps on trying to prove the the origin of God every time wrongly. Like you always try to say like you guys you guys come from apes. You guys came from ape. Like when did, where did the ape come from? Exactly. And because, even if we came from ape, why is the ape not evolving? Yeah. That that's it gets me confused every time because they keep on trying to prove it wrong and the facts still remain we came from somewhere. And it's from the holy place. It's from God. Muslims, you guys just draw me very close to you every time I watch such video. Like it's it's he was giving us details in Quran. 
Like mm. this is where it was written. This is the verse it was written. This is it. This is it. Science are not discovering it. Yeah, and it has been there for fourteen hundred years, years ago. ago. Because it has been written down it, there. It baffles me why people feel like we don't. We don't. We, we just existed. It's not possible. Nothing just existed like that. Nothing. Something was. Something made this happen. Like this world, we have money. We have night. People over here. Yeah, it will be nice. These people over here will be money. How is it possible? How? How, how is it possible that two water meet together and, and they don't they don't mix? They don't mix. There is science something. There is something. No matter how science science try proving it wrong, God exists. That is a plain truth. That is. They should believe what I want to believe. I'm believing what I be, what I want to believe because I've totally read the scripture. And I'm a true believer of Christ. And every word that was being written there, I believe it. Because I knew at the end there of there's more to life than drinking, smoking, full of women, mourning, full of this world, growing old and dying. There is more. There is you have to account to everything you have done in this world. This world is a test. That's true. And someone is watching us. So no matter how you think, oh, it's just here, I'm going to live. There's somewhere else you are going. There's a second journey. This is just the first. So you have to be mindful of where you are right now. You have to live in a very good life. And it's a very exemplary life because it's like you having a child, you want your child to be like you. You don't have to live worldly because your child will copy you. To be an example for your kids. It's very, very important. Like... This, it just opened my eyes right now, guys. He said, he said there's a word like, no matter how human try to create eye, there's no eye that's as powerful as a natural one, one that's being given to you. So no matter how, how many cameras they try to create, there's no one that is as powerful as the, the eye that is being given to you. Guys, this is 12 pro max. No matter how sharp it is, it is not as sharp as my eye, guys. That's true. That is also the plain truth. Because he also said, this world come together, combined, cannot still create an ant, a fly, sorry. Mm. So it's, it's totally true, guys. This fly was made by God. It was made by God to be in this world for a purpose. Everything makes sense when you read the scripture, when you read Quran, when you, when you read Bible, guys, it makes sense. According to my religion, when I read my Bible, guys, it all makes sense. It all comes back to where it started from. Like if you read from Genesis to Revelation, you'll be like, oh, it's like they were relating to yeah. from Genesis. Like everything is just going accordingly, guys. So you live your life, but live it in a very, very good manner that you will not be ashamed to show your book to God at the judgment seat. At the judgment day, guys. So you have to be like, yeah, I'm proud of what I've done. What do you think about it, This is got me Terry because everything he was saying was true. Totally. Like from the beginning, we were just talking about how we are here on earth. We just want to make money, live our life, grow old, and die. Is, is that just it? I don't feel that it's just it to life. I feel that there's more possibilities and more things we can do. And at the end of the day, we have to talk about what we've lived in life. We have to show our book and say, this is what I did on earth. This is how I lived. I helped people. I did a lot of things. I lived a holy and a righteous life. Because... In the end, we, are ha we have to give testament to what we have done on earth. Yeah, that's true. So, yeah, when you were talking about things that we are seeing now in the 21st century that have been in the Bible for a very long time, because the scientists are just discovering most of it now, but it has been there from the beginning. Yeah. So when people just be like, we revolve from apes. Okay, if we revolve from apes, I don't think we will be giving birth. Instead, we'll just be coming out from the apes and be living our life because that's where we're coming from. Just like plants, if um, you're going to get an orange for the tree, yeah. you're just going to keep on getting it from there because that's where it started from. So when people just like become, you know, that's their own perspective. I'm not going to tell them to stop believing that, but I believe that we came through God. God created human beings. God created the animals, the trees, every single thing on earth. Here. Because nothing. Like if you look at us, just look at your fingers. Each of your fingers have different fingerprints. How? Like how? Who can do that? If not the Messiah, if not God. Yes. This it just made me I feel so happy watching this because he's just saying literally everything that's happening, literally yeah. what we are going through. And if this is not proof for you to believe that there's someone above, there's an almighty God above, I I don't know what. 
this was a wonderful and a beautiful declaration i love what he says i really, really enjoyed every bit of it and i'll love to hear it over and over again love it so guys coming up below your first time watching this video how was your reaction give us a thumbs up share this video as many as time subscribe to the channel guys and how it is see you guys in this video make sure you stay safe i just want a bag like a old lady i'm back wood smoking i don't own papers pass that 808 that don't don't shake her oh bitch you know i'm grinding like a pro skater baby mama bugging i'm so quick to hit ignore buku bitch in my bed i got scales all